the world continues to be confronted by the threat of globalized terrorism closely associated with organized crimes as well as non-traditional threats by traditional criminal cartels that impede the socio-economic progress of mankind. Sri Lanka continues to support multilateral efforts to enhance peace and security and eliminate all forms of terrorism. Sri Lanka was fortunate to have ended the terrorist challenge three years ago, largely through its own efforts. I strongly believe that ending a threat of this nature and overcoming the challenges in its government requires a homegrown people-based approach as in the case of my country. Similarly, the international community must support countries facing the threat of terrorism. There can be no double standards or the selective application of standards and principles if we are to eliminate this menace. We also uphold the principle that sovereignty must be respected and equal treatment accorded to all. Non-interference in the internal affairs of states has clearly reflected in the UN Charter and the principle of NAM must remain an abiding principle to be followed in spirit and letter.